lemon. I believe this is lemon. Got some of those Italian like fruit jimmies. Oh baby. Okay. The good stuff. What? What? Oh no, bring it on. My god. So okay. delicious. Yeah, Kasu is so positive, it breaks reality. He's just so nice. Consumed by fear, huh? Here we go. Let's get it done. Murder that man. I think we're getting better at this. There are a lot of angry dots on the screen. Hey, Ichiban, do you use coconut oil? What? In I cooking? Don't get smoked. Bring it on. Okay. Just a man in a <laughs> bathrobe? God damn it, guarding. Cosmic scales must be balanced. Yeah, teamwork. It'd be nice if more than one person could break guard. <laughs> I'm guessing he hired another person. I don't know what the nouveau rich ability did. I got behind you. Oh my god, incredible. Dead. Ah, uh, yep, there we go. Big Doug Ibrahim has arrived. Grab him. Throw him. Bash him. But also, don't forget this guy. Finish the job. Ooh. Allow me. He's not getting back up. Before we move off topic here. Hey, Ichiban. Damn it. There's a million people in front of me. Okay, I'm up. And one of them looks like Charlie Day. Looks like I'm up. Oof. Just bash that guy's penis in. Poor Bummer Strummer. No, don't get it. Just stay down, Bummer Strummer. Hit his dick. Perfect. And finish the job. Stop him in. Prevent him from ever standing ever again. Hey, Ichiban. Do you use coconut oil? There's another conversation right ahead. Okay, I gotta finish this one. has the best stuff. Makes your skin silky smooth. You should give it a try while you're still here. It's like magic. Not sure an old guy like me needs to worry about silky smooth skin at this point. Oh, he needs to worry. No way. Taking care of yourself is always important. A well-kept man is attractive. Oh. No kid. Because hmm. having softer skin would be nice. I suppose yep. I could have some softer Everything skin. Everything soft in the head. Quit really opening up. Coconut oil. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Usually, but recently, they keep getting canceled due to storms. 
Would you call yourself a Feel like a soft-skinned brick shit house is the idea. We want to be nice and supple. Loud songs supple. While you get down with your favorite drink. That's fun because it feels so free. Man, I can't wait to go again. Well, in that case, Tara, it's like oh, we're all right. Just gonna go ahead and fast forward to that so I can get Aloha. some shopping done. Never mind, everything's a million fucking dollars. Good day. Chicken, hello. A cock! I will give this chicken a natural herb. It was a good choice. The chicken's now well seasoned and ready for roasting. Right? You look great for someone in his 40s. She wants to turn you into a wallet. Let's go on, Zabatsu. You've been flying through this game. You're on like chapter six, seven. Just bump up, bump, butt bumped that man into oblivion. But oblivion. Give me the biggest shave ice you got, please. Oh, of course, right away. Oh, I'm gonna need the like biggest sure. shaved ice you no, have. No flavor, just give me the ice. Um, all right, just a moment. Ah, uh, here you go, sir. A uh, large shave ice, no flavoring. Okay, much obliged. Looks delicious. Oh, I, yeah. <laughs> huh? uh, damn it. Now he's a wet What's old man. With this guy, is he all right? Sarah, hey, are you all right Mister, in the head? You uh. Overheating or something? Wouldn't want to catch a cold. Huh? Who are you? If you got a better idea, tell me. Otherwise, shove off! Shave off! Sorry? Shaved ice off. I ain't got time for this crap. Maybe if the ice were more powdery, it turned to snow. I gotta try! God damn, these are good candies. Did you say snow? Let it go. I mean, let it snow. Aloha! Mmm. Mmm, strawberry. Thank you very I'm just gonna keep these in my goddamn pocket, I guess. Got a bunch of... bunch of shaved ice in my pocket. Aloha! Aloha. A different chicken? Bacock! I wonder how many chickens I could be friends with in this game. What is this? Oh yeah, that's the Pokemon items dispenser. Hello! Hello! hello. Hey. I said hello! Don't you dare ignore me. Aloha! I'm not a surfer Thank yet, you. so uh <gasps> Charging Station, finally! But also. Three coconuts! Aloha. Charge. Goddamn hundred dollars to charge by my moped. 
outrageous. I don't see many taxis cruising. <coughs> well, people tend to reserve rides from their hotels or catch one in <coughs> taxi port. Taxi drivers in Hawaii or... There you are. They're generally a pretty friendly, good nature. Unless they got to low down on all the spots, so... <laughs> Just watch it crash into a car immediately. Yeah, you're awfully knowledgeable. Almost as if you're nice car, loser! Hey, I'm a taxi driver to the bump. Just don't have a car. We're really opening up. Mm hmm. This on. Get off the Segway. My smoke alarm? No. Hmm. I don't hear any beeping. You're looking at everything we know about Akane-san. It took an entire organization to gather this. But all it really amounts to is a birth date and an address. He gave it all up, my dear. That doesn't sound right. Kiryu-san, I thought that agency was all 007, like with spies and stuff. Spies! Shouldn't they be able to write the entire books on someone? Yeah, what gives? Could be she's harder to track as a member of the general public. Whereas if she kept There's also just a lot of people, you know? There'd be no shortage of news coming in. A lot of people in the world. In. Ah, good point. Chitose. It can be the tiniest detail. But if you know anything that's not on here, we need to know too. Her favorite movie Actually, was High School Musical 3. Oh, yeah? What is it? None of this says anything about her career. Her career? Yeah. Kane-san's the director of an orphanage. She's been there, like, forever. No kidding. Well, Captain Sawashiro never mentioned anything like that. I mean, he only just he recently told you that <laughs> that's your mom. I haven't been to the place in person, but I do know where it is, if you're interested. Alright, here's the money-making minigame. We sell children from an orphanage. Might have the clues we need. Agreed. Let's head over there. It wasn't his money, Mario. It was the company's money. It's getting late. Let's try that orphanage tomorrow. Still, it's a bit early to hit the hay. Could wander around a little. Hmm? Tommy's drinking all by himself. I haven't really had much time to chat since we teamed up. Maybe I should go talk to him. So, uh, you come here often? Give these tables some chairs. Yo, tell me. Mind if I join you? I was just hoping for a drinking partner. Ha, ah, then I'm your man. I'm an excellent drinking partner. All right. Your turn. Oh. I just drank. Some days it really hits the spot. You much of a drinker, usually? Kind of. Except when I came to Hawaii. I got so wasted my clothes were stolen. Hard to claim I can hold my liquor after that. <laughs> oh, yeah. The culprit's Why? in the background. What about you? I've cut back lately. Uh, a while ago, I was going way too hard. Yeah, trying to forget. Oh, forget about Marie, you mean? Thanks a lot. Yeah, more or less. I just remembered because of you. Tommy's old flame, Marie. While he was in prison at the Barracudas, framed him. She vanished. Yeah, but, you know, hey. Vanished. Time heals Not all dead. wounds is what they always say. Even being stripped bare-assed in public. Now, you'll laugh about it in a few years. <laughs> Honestly, that was nothing. I bet Marie's doing well. That doesn't seem like a great reward. <laughs> As time healed your wounds. Honestly, that was nothing. Keep it light. Keep it friendly. I've been through worse, honestly. But we won't get into how the family used to treat me. Like, family family? My boss She's in a better place now. Rough. He once got everyone calling me Ichi Bad Kasuga. <laughs> <laughs> Veteran of hard knocks, I see. The Barracudas ruined way more lives than just mine and Marie's, you know? I mean, uh, 
frame job scam was old hat by the time they got me. It's just... Hard to imagine anyone else took it at their happiest moment. You know, like I did. Girl I loved was having my kid. I would have given anything for one more day with her. Sorry. I shouldn't have brought it up. Eh, don't be an idiot. Always thinking about it anyway. So the night that Marie and I first met... Oh, you want to talk about this? Do you mind? It's been a long time since I told this story. Let me get through it. Well, I'm happy to listen, I guess, if, if you're okay. <laughs> I guess I'm happy to oh, listen. I mean, you I, if you're gonna... Over, uh, you have to. Ugh, means I've been calving that long, too. Back then, I'd spend my nights at clubs, picking up girls, which, of course, went nowhere, usually. Usually? <laughs> that, that word's doing some heavy lifting. <laughs> Do you want to hear my story? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay, okay. Shut so, up, Peter Gallery! One night, I hit on this girl. With a boyfriend. I wouldn't normally do that, but I was... That's a... That's bad form. Bad form. And the boyfriend? Like, he's this massive pro-wrestler-looking lifter. And he dragged me to an alley, and he kicked the shit out of me so bad, I thought I might actually die. That's the worst pickup story ever. Does Marie really show up in it? Stop interrupting, I'll get you. <laughs> so I'm lying in the alley. Rolling out my guts. And then Do you even want me here hearing the story? Finds me and cleans me up. Marie just happened to be there that night with one of her co-workers. And we'd never seen one another before. But there she was. Caring for a total stranger. Staying in her nice clothes with my blood. Wow, well, that's something special. With my blood. Yeah. Probably the worst night of my life. Before she made it the best. Sure as hell, I made a move on her. I mean, how could I let someone like that slip away? But right. You know, it's funny. You know, I say it's the best night of my life, but down the road, well, it's not like it was your fault. Ruining hers. Wow, Tommy. When we found out she was pregnant, she quit her job. Six months later, I was in prison, all because a scumbag like me couldn't let her go. She could have had so much better. It's because Danny Trejo did it to you. It wasn't your fault. None of it was your fault, Tommy. The only people to blame are the Barracudas. Doesn't matter. Marie was involved because they chose me. So I'm the blame. Hey, Tommy. Do you ever think about trying to locate her? You said she would visit you, right? In the beginning, at least? Of course I tried looking for her. First thing I did. No luck. When I got back to our home... Everything of hers was gone. Not a trace left behind. Don't follow me. Doesn't get much clearer. <sighs> I left exactly. this amazing woman to suffer all on her own. As she'd lost a child. Well, you were Whatever in prison. circumstances might have been. You can't go on with someone after that. Not your fault. You know what? I'm a pretty bad judge of character. Huh? Why, why you say that? <laughs> the first time we met, you pulled a gun on me, remember? If you asked me then, I'd have said you were nothing more than a petty crook. But now, listening to you, I think everybody's carrying something you can't see right away. Everybody out there. <laughs> I'd almost forgotten about sticking you up. How could you forget? Did I ever apologize so to you for that? It doesn't matter anymore. Uh, no. Some things do matter. Huh? I am sorry for the way we met, Ichiban. Well, I you're love forgiven. You. If you buy the next round, let bygones be. I just don't rob anybody else either. No promises. <laughs> I'll do my best. No promises. Raising your bond with your friends will eventually trigger drink links. With these heart to hearts, your allies can unlock powerful abilities such as tag team skills, combo attacks, Eiffel Towering somebody, initiate drink links at hangouts like Revolve, check their progress via your bondage menu in the pause menu. Thomas Howe's bond with the team has enhanced his skills. He can now use Cross Slugger. After forming a bond with your friends, you'll be able to tag team with them. 
It's as sexual as you think it is. Tag team skills are powerful combo attacks that can be performed without spending MP. Once a hype meter is filled, press R2 to initiate a tag team skill. Don't worry about it. Perfectly normal. Just bros being bros. <laughs> nice to mellow out with a drink once in a while. Hey. Hey, what are you doing tonight? It's getting late and you look pretty drunk. Maybe sleep it off upstairs, yeah? You don't mind? Not at all. Like I said, you're free to make yourself a home. Thanks. Thanks, I owe you one. Time to hit the town. We should rest. Fine, make me go to bed. I understand. Five dollars. You want to sing? That'll put everyone to bed. Let's go. I'm legally obligated to do the karaoke once per game. Let's get ready to rock! I forgot to pay attention to the buttons they just showed me. Songs. Sing. Oh my god. City lights. <laughs> There's a lot of Cosmo songs. Everyone always wants Bakumi time. Obviously passionate backup. Now, let me your ears. Here, you yeah. suck. Oh, we're on backup. A nice mournful song with incredibly enthusiastic backup singing. Time. A JSON file. We would probably have to change the language to Japanese. That's some nice singing. This is a karaoke bar after all. Knocking back a stiff drink while someone else sings. 
God, that's just the best. I hope you keep coming back to sing your heart out. Felt wrong in English, right? I'm so embarrassed to go to bed. I can't believe we're stuck in front of everyone. <laughs> Where's my bed? Oh, hey. Heroes nunchaku. <laughs> Do it again. Where are my heroes, Nunchaku? What the hell are they, if not these? One day we'll have the power to change our godforsaken jobs. Kick punch. It's all in your mind. It's, it's a weapon. It has a little punchy symbol, which makes me think you, you could... Got maracas? I'm using what? My my golf club? Two grass cutters? Ah. Uh. Bedtime. What was that noise? I've been a fool. That was the bar ghost. Oh my god, I received an image from Jimmy of him downloading Helldivers 2. He finally did it. Life is good. Oh no. Oh yeah. Let's head out to the orphanage. Hopefully we'll get some info on a common sign. Hi, hands. We gotta go up here. Drinks later. Look at all this stuff lighting up. That was convenient. What's this? I can look through garbage. You chose the wrong man to fight! I'm unhinged! He has a gun! That's how you know it's America. Beat him with that bug on a stick! Here we go. Is Bellatro really good? I know a lot of folks are playing it. Allow me. I imagine it's the kind of game I would very much enjoy, but this is too much right now. There's so many games! Let's take out the trash! Looks like you're gonna be my new Pokemon. Why don't you climb up inside of my ball? What do you want? Oh, put me inside a small ball. I got candy. There you go. There's a little something Come on. Come on over here and have the candy. Oh. I won't trap you forever. Nope. Sorry. You son of a bitch. I'll kill you. I forgot I was supposed to hammer the X button. I, I didn't hammer it for half the time. He ran away. Oh man. Can't believe he doesn't want to live inside of a cramped little ball. Forever. With no hope of escape. I forgot to praise the man. Fine then. Well, it looks like you guys 
our new chance to put someone in a small ball. Come here. One of you's coming home with me. Have a ride. Bicycle. Here we go. Oh. Oh, he was already dead, man. <laughs> the sound of the bike still rolling around. Man, they're just leaving swords on the ground? That's nuts. Let me at him. Oh, aloha. How? There's more shaved ice? Does Hawaii not have anything else? Thanks very much. Dopamine drip of unlocking stuff. Selling some delicious looking cookies for five dollars. We're at level nine bonds. Really? Give it to someone who's only a level I one bond. getting hungry. Chitose wants candy. Oh, look at all the goodies here. Just like the old timey sweet shops back home. You're into Japanese sweets? Yeah, they're all so bright and colorful. Although I've never actually gone and bought any myself. Really? Never? Nope. Really? Read about them in books. I'd love to actually try them sometime. Yeah, I'm good. And I gotta take you to a real old fashioned mom and pop shop back in Japan. Oh! <laughs> Didn't get to hit me with a car. Three hundred yen worth of snacks. My treat. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> no pun intended. Thank you. Get your goddamn passport oh back from her. Do 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 do. I'll show you true fear. An average level of 22. <laughs> Goodbye. Skirt. You're not listening to me. I just said ice. No damn syrup of fruit. What? Look, old man, I've heard from other shops how you're going around buying ice and just covering yourself with it, you little pervert. Take pride in what I sell. I'm not going to let you get your jollies off on my product. You need to cool down, take a swim. If you're angling for some weird lawsuit against us, you should just give up. What the hell are you talking about? Uh, jollies? I'm being serious here, please. He's, he looks, he kind of looks like if you took Bill Clinton and like left him out in the sun too long. Next customer. Damn, the old man's got himself blackballed from every shaved ice place around here. Gets that's no surprise. After when I'm curious what the guy's goal is. Yo. <coughs> hey, old man. Hmm? Oh, you again. Come to laugh at me now that I can't keep chucking ice into the sky like the damn fool I am. I wouldn't do that. I'm criminally nice. I'm just curious what you're trying to do. You seem pretty serious about it. Don't look at the texture on that desk. Don't look at it. I, I can't, no matter where I turn my eyes, I'm still catching it. It's making me feel weird. You mentioned turning the ice into snow, right? Y yeah. Yes. Ain't like I was trying to quench my thirst on straight ice. It's for my wife to show her some freshly fallen snow. Hmm? In Hawaii? You have to be... I have to have better ops taking a trip, man, like go to Alaska or somewhere. Don't you think we would have if we could, you stupid asshole? My wife's sick. Ain't much able to get out of bed anymore. She could go at any time now. So I've been asking her for something, anything I could do for her. Most of the time, she's not all there when we talk. But I damn well heard her say, I want to see the snow with you again. We have some good memories in the snow. 
went to Japan on our honeymoon, you know. That was the first time we saw the stuff. We both felt like we'd been whisked away to another world. Always promised her we'd go again someday, but, well, you know how life can be. A huge bitch. Hard to take time off work for something as silly as snow. I never made much money, so I've always worked doubly hard for my family. All this time, I'm not sure how she felt about that. And now it's too late to ask. All I know is she's always been there for me without a word of complaint. Funny, it was only after I retired and could start making methamphetamines again that we realized how sick she was. Oh. We'd missed the early warning signs. It, it was too late by then. Oh, I'm sorry. She gave me everything she had to give in this life, and I can provide her this one damn thing in return. Curse you, weather! And to think, I was excited when she first said she wanted to see snow again. Figured it'd be easy. How hard could it be to make snow out here in fucking Hawaii? And I could make her happy. For all I know, she'd be too out of it to even realize. But maybe I just need to feel like I did something for her. I was thinking maybe I could have some air lifted in from another country. But there's just no time. <sighs> so I could think of was shaved ice. You were trying to see if maybe it'd fall down like snow. I get it. Hell, I might have tried something just as crazy in your shoes. But in this heat, there's no way it'd ever build up without melting. And now I can't even buy more if I wanted to. What do I do? It can't end like this, can it? Now, Hawaii, Gosh. of course, geologically active area, is a string of volcanoes that form the islands. Are there any mountains in Hawaii that are snow caps? I don't know this. Are there? No, it can't. Hmm? I appreciate you telling me your story, but now there's no way I could just wish you luck and head off. We're in this together, old man. Leave it to me. Let me try to think of something. You go home. Be with your wife. I, uh, I'm not sure what to say. Thank you. <laughs> Never mind, I thought it up. It was thank you. I doubt many would care so much for an old man chucking ice onto himself. Name's Orlando Bloom. You? Ichiban Kasuga. I'm from Japan, actually. And apparently we're speaking fluent English right now, both of us. Oh. No kidding! Japan, huh? Maybe this is fate. Whoa. Of course. Can't exactly say I got any great ideas off the bat. Give me a little time if you can. I will. For now, it's just nice to know that someone from the country that meant so much to my wife and me is willing to help. You got it. I'll get in touch if I find any leads. See you soon. We'll be seeing you. Snow, huh? Jeez, how are we gonna pull that off? You're seeing some audio desync on me? That's interesting. Was there audio desync all earlier? Did it only recently happen? Alright, it's synced up from Mighty Odin. It should be synced. Like, the way we're doing this right now, it should basically be lined up without any interference on mine. Interesting. Some drift. Doo -doo -doo -doo. A second? I feel like a second would have been super obvious for Mighty Oak. Hey, hey, 
You're running late already. Come on over here. Huh? Looks like I, I got a new job. Experience? Don't sweat it. Just bring that same friendly face you had in the interview. You're even more amiable in person. <laughs> I can tell. It's great to have you on board, Palakiko. Hey, hang on a second. You confused or something? I'm not Paula... whoever. Huh? Is the no, game audio desynced? Kazu Palakiko, right? I hate to break it to you. My name's Kasuga. But where is he then? He's already an hour and 20 minutes late. What the... Hasn't it dawned on you that he's not coming? He might not no, be coming. No, Palakiko wouldn't do that to me. We had a real connection in our interview. Your online interview, you mean? Sorry, but it sounds like you got suckered. No, 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 no. Even through a computer screen, I could tell he was a good guy. He had such compassionate eyes. Like yours. You got the same kind of handsome face. Uh, oh, uh, that's sweet of you. Ah, Gasuga, you Well, we got right. folks talking now. It should be obvious. But then I can't open a restaurant, and I'm fully booked today. Well, uh, haven't you got any part timers you could call in? Ah, like it won't be perfect because, you know, it's approach. a video game. I've kept a handle on things so far by limiting our tables. Boop, 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 boop. Not really practical. So, Paula Kiko was going to help you finally start serving a full house? Yes, you understand. Paula I'm ready Kiko. to cook or God, serve. You think he was in an Already cooked food. That would explain everything. I get that you don't want to believe he ditched you, but if you got no backup, you need to start turning folks away. Where am I going to find backup? A waiter needs exactly the right kind of face. He needs eyebrows like curious caterpillars. A nose stout enough to withstand a knockout punch. Eyes gray like fog, slinking over alleyway trash bags. Here I thought they only had to serve oh, food. Wait a moment. Why didn't I see it sooner? Palakiko's dead ringer right in front of me. And just imagine how you'll fill out the uniform. Forgive me. It'll just be for today, I swear. You'll help me, won't you? Kasuga, my friend. My friend. Sorry, but I've got zero skill in food service. And it didn't happen yesterday. Nonsense. It'll be fine. After all, you Today and yesterday, same exact setup. Things. No change. That's interesting. Kasuga, your arrival here is practically fate. I'll pay you, of course. And you can even eat here. What do you say? Waiting tables, huh? Worst ways to make money, I guess. Kasuga, thank you, thank you. Now, you mentioned you have no experience, didn't you? Yeah, I got no idea how this is supposed to work. Okay, allow me to go over the basics with you. This way, please. Come, this way. I mean, there's not much we could do. Like, if it's inconsistent oh. like this, it's not like I could change a number and that number's gonna work every time. Because yesterday we did uh, an extra long stream, even. And as far as I know, no desync yesterday. So it's weird that it would happen today. I knew you felt the uniform. Look, like you've worn it a hundred times before. Welcome to Trop. <laughs> Come on, you're embarrassing me with all this. Just realized I never introduced myself. My name is Obispo. You can call me Obi for short. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Got it, nice to meet you, Obi. Yeah. That one game made you motion sick? After that, we did uh, Aliens Dark Descent. And that one causes like a decent amount of uh, system hits like it's uh, it very very uh oh you were not asking me to clap <clears throat> it's a very system intensive game alien start to set so if anything was going to cause drift by like lagging this and going over there oh i like that first things first greeting our guests always be considerate of the customers if they're speaking softly to one another we must not go Aloha! Welcome to Tropical, you beautiful 
SOB! That would be quite startling, yes? Y yeah you could say that. Enthusiasm's good, but too much. It's overwhelming. Match the mood of the guest! Are they cheery, or are they refined? Right on. Yeah. Great! Next. Let's go over the most popular dishes on our menu. Huh? Are you familiar with Hawaiian cuisine, Kazuga? Can't say that I am, really. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, that's no problem. Take a look with me. On the top left is our signature dish, ahi pokey. Ahi tuna flavored with seaweed and soy sauce, a quintessential Hawaiian delicacy. Next to that is the acai bowl. As the name suggests, we blend acai fruit into a smoothie and add honey, fruits, and other ingredients for this refreshing treat. On the upper right is lau lau. That's uh, meat or fish wrapped between two leaves, or lau as we call them. Our lau lau uses pork and potato wrapped in taro leaves, and we steam it for an extra long time. On the bottom left, loco moco. That's one dish that I've heard of before. It's a popular dish in Japan too, isn't it? Juicy hamburger patty, fried onions, sunny side up egg, served on rice and topped with our house gravy. Now that's a bestseller. Next that is the Haupia. Standard dessert made from coconut milk. Melts in your mouth. Finally on the bottom right, Mahi Mahi. Premium fish in Hawaii. We grill it fresh to a slight char and then top it with our special olive oil. It's simple, but perfect. I also want all of this stuff. <sighs> Okay, upper left to right, ahi pokey, acai bowl, lao lao, uh, loco moco, hopia, and mahi mahi. Jeez, this is a lot. There's no spam here? Might seem confusing at the start, but I'm sure with passion like yours, Kasuga, you'll have it down in no time. Remember, don't sweat the small stuff. Everybody makes mistakes, except for natural-born waiters like you, because if you do mess up, I'll kill you. Oh, I, I appreciate your faith. Oh. Oh, it's time to open. Were you here yesterday, Taco? I feel like I remember you being here yesterday. Did you notice any yesterday? Because again, same setup. Totally. Oh, I don't remember any of this. We're going to fail horribly. Yeah. Yeah, let's do this indeed. For the first time ever, every table in Tropical is open for business. I'll be in the kitchen. Casca, you just work your magic. Hey! Ciao! Mm, baby, it smells divine in here. It was fine for Unicorn. All right. Okay, she seems energetic. My greeting should be like... Used to adjust the intensity, tone, and nuance. You know it! Welcome to Tropical! Oh, uh -huh, are you new here? I love your vibe. Thank you. Ah, uh, thanks. All right, nailed the greeting. I wonder what the next customer will be like. My hello there, chum. Dear me, I am utterly famished. He's so classy. Better greet him the right way. Greeting, sir. Thank you for dining at Trumbo. My, my, what a smart lad. Are you new to this establishment? Oh, somewhat. I'm just helping out for today. Oh, is that so? What a waste of talent to you, my friend. Know how to make a man feel aroused. Thank you. Well, I appreciate the compliment. Hey, not bad. Guess my time at Hello Work is still paying off. Wow, all the tables are filling up. Papa! Mama! I'm starving! 
I demand loco moco, mama and papa. Hungry, hello, waiter. I need num nums in my tum tums. Get ready for a feast. Welcome to Tropical. Yay! <laughs> You're the loudest waiter ever met. Super funny. <laughs> oh, nice. I got you, kid. All right. Most of the tables are filled. Now things get tough. Yeah. I want to eat a dolphin. Bring me a dolphin. Gasugo, well done seating the guests and serving them drinks so far. <sighs> oh, sure. Dealing with the different kinds of customers can be tricky. Hope I could take their orders without a problem. Excuse me. I'm ready to order. Um, sir. Waiter. Yes. All right. Be right with you. <laughs> you got this. Take down their orders and bring them back to me. I'm thinking of Ahi Pokey. And a hopia for dessert. All right, I am pokey. Make it two hopies. Uh, all right, two of those. Actually, oh, more. Uh, three of them. Yes, three of them. Yes. All at the same time. Oh Jesus. One ace bones. One lao lao. No, wait. Make it lao lao and hopia. All right, four hopies. And maybe Loco Moco, too. You know what? Go with my first order. Yes. Fuck! Gonna get none of this right. Hello again, chum. I tell inquire what's in your lao lao. Pork and potato, sir. Pork, you say? Mm, no, that won't do. I never sup on swine. I'll have the mahi mahi, thank you. Yes. Very good, sir. Ah, I'm fine. All right, orders from three tables here. Read them out to me, would you? All right, the cheerful customer ordered. An ahi pokey and three halpies. That looks right, yes. The elegant customer ordered. Mahi, mahi. Sushi, sushi. Customer in black ordered. Acai bowl and lao lao. Yeah. Fantastic, I'll get cooking then. Order up, ready yes. to go. All right, I'm on it. All right, Ahi Pokey and Triple Hoppies. Bellissima. Oh, the fragrance. Obi is simply a miracle worker, isn't he? Enjoy, you weirdo. <laughs> Nailed it. Uh, thank you for your patience, sir. Your Mahi Mahi has orders. My word, it smells delectable. Grilled to perfect char on top of that special olive oil you see. Ah, yes, that's precisely what I'm getting from it. Marvelous! Thank you so much. Please enjoy. <laughs> it was damn near perfect. And thank you for your patience, one ice bowl and lao lao. Looks great. Enjoy. <laughs> Score! Got that just right. <sighs> oh, damn tough trying to remember all those orders. Yeah. Kasaka, I need a free hand. Could you run that lao lao to the table with the family? Right. Hey, sushi wasn't on the menu before. Right, the lao lao is the left dish.
Here's your garbage, you fucking animals. Eat up. That looks so good. Can I have some? Oh, Tom, he'll order the Loco Moco. Just wait, it'll be here soon. I hope you're allergic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. Never let me say Ichiban Kasuka doesn't know his Lao Lao. Yeah, you have to say you too after they say enjoy the meal. Next order up. Take the Kalua pig over to the family's table, yes? The what? Leave the Mahi Mahi and Ahi Pokey there for now. Just the pig, please. Alright, so right now I'm looking at... The middle dish, please. There we go. It's the only one I haven't seen before. Maybe your patience. Here's your pig. That one's mine. It looks so tasty. Oh, Mama! No one Mama! Look. Now. Smells good, too. Thank you so much, Mr. Waiter. Of course, enjoy the pig. Enjoy supping on swine. <laughs> yeah, someone doesn't want their pig wrapped up. Got that pig pegged. <sighs> I think that's finally yeah. it. Great job, Kasuga. You made it through a full service. Jeez, and I always thought Hawaiian food was pretty close to Japan's. Show what it says now. Shows what I know. <laughs> I could see how some of it might have been strange to you. Excuse me. Huh? I think they're ordering some more, Casca. Go and see. Yes. Right away. Hello again. Was there anything else you needed? Actually, I'd like to speak to the owner. Hmm? Oh, of course. Is there a problem? Please, if you don't mind. Oh, and what's their name, by the way? The owner's name? It's, uh... Obispo. Yes. Did you call me, Kasuga? What can I do for you? Well, as a matter of fact, I'm a culinary reporter. And I have to say, I've been quite impressed. That was the best loco moco I've ever had in all my days. Huh? Oh, I thank you. I'm so flattered. If you're up for it, I'd love to feature a restaurant in my magazine. Get out of town. Tropical's never had any media coverage before. Well, let's change that, shall we? You know, I've wanted to come here for some time, but you're always at capacity. Uh-huh, well, it's all thanks to my new waiter and friend and lover that we were able to accommodate you. I can tell that he's exceptional waitstaff. He was running around all through service, trying to keep everyone happy. You found yourself some great help, and I'm sure he's a giving, compassionate lover as well. Thank you. Well, thanks, guys. This is just a part-time gig for me, though. So what do you think, Chef Obispo? Care for an interview? Yeah. Absolutely. Here's my card. Here's my card. I'll come see you again soon. Thank you so much. Kasuga, you're my lucky charm, my angel, my bosom buddy. I don't know how to thank you. Uh, I hope I didn't do anything. It was all your cooking. Uh, don't get modest on me here. Let me pay you for your work. You get an employee meal. You get a book. And here's $300. Hmm? Wow, all this cash and these bento look amazing. <laughs> Your service was perfect, Kasuga. It was like you've been doing this for years. This bonus is the least I could offer. <laughs> you say so. You really know how to reward hard work, mister. Kasuga, you just might have saved my business. I'm oh so no, let's great. not go that way. You come back for a bento whenever you want, got it? I mean that. Oh, good deal. Well, then, I suppose I'll have to find full-time help now. He's hoping they're as good as you. They won't be. I'm sure there are plenty of people out there. Mr. Employee people with Meals? experience, even. No, 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 no. Haven't I proven it to you by now, you handsome rogue? Kasuga, the face makes the server. No. You might have bailed on me, but Palakiko had that face, too. 
I knew it the moment I saw him. How good could he be if he bailed? Oh, but Kasuga, you proved how skilled he would have been. You two are dead <laughs> readers for one another. You share that trustworthy <laughs> visage. Obi, sir. You're wrong. You really believe in my face that much, huh? <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, gosh. I'm late. I know. I was supposed to start a working dead today. ringer. A name's Kazu Palakiko. I don't look anything like this guy. <laughs> God, I feel the passion flowing through. Am I actually going somewhere on the map or am I going to a taxi? Let's go! Skirt! Hold on! Okay, I got it. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm just gonna veer off the road violently whenever we see a thing pick up. Skirt! It's dog food! Where do we keep these segways when we're not using them? Wait. Oh no. Oh no. Level 18. He's got a shotgun. It's in hammer space. I hope I get the car. Just shot his own car. So many follow up attacks. I should probably try and heal my Let's friend over there. Tech team! Oh my god, he got run over by a car. R.I.P. that dude. Can I? No, we're not hitting multiple. Wait, push in front of a car. Oh, I got him. I saved him. I pushed him out of traffic. Thank you, fear. Yeah, mess him up. I think I'm getting stronger. Yes, I'm a fast learner. Everyone leveled up from that.
Hey, bud, you want to live in my pocket? There you go. Will this persuade you? Uh, what? No way. All right. You count on me. My new friend. Welcome to my pocket, you monster. We ride! What's this? What is it? It was Sushi Munch. Swing wide around the fucking car, please. Whoa, Jesus! Fast and loose with traffic laws! I feel like driving in the center, dead center of the road, on the yellow medium. It's like that's the worst place to be on your Segway. You have equal opportunity to be hit from both lanes of traffic. The sidewalk might be better. A bike lane would probably be the ideal. 